Hi fellow kindergarten and first grade teachers. I'm here today to talk to you about Edmodo. It's an educational website that takes the ideas of a social network and refines them to make them more appropriate for the classroom. We can use Edmodo to connect with students, with other teachers, and with the outside world through things like the Global Read Aloud. I'm going to take you through a quick overview so you can get some ideas about ways that you could use Edmodo in your kindergarten and first grade classroom. Then later we'll go through step by step and I'll show you how you can sign up to get an account of your own. Let's get started. In our busy Daily 5 classroom students are doing a variety of different activities. We of course are already given directions on how to play for example a partner game. Sometimes students need additional instruction or clarification. That's where Edmodo can come in handy. You can embed or add right to the Edmodo stream for your classroom directions on how to play the game. It's almost like having an extra pair of hands in the classroom. Here let's take a look and I'll show you what I mean. When students log into Edmodo they can click on the link that you have ready for them. To set up the game the board will be in the middle like I said, everyone will have their own Unifix cube. You can see that I have a green one. Put it here at the start of the game and get ready to play. You're going to be listening for the middle. I'll stop the directions there, but you can see that it's really going to be easy for students to get the directions as many times as they need to by clicking on the link in Edmodo. As teachers, we try to keep our parents informed so that they know what's going on in the classroom and that way they can be more informed co-educators. So Edmodo really makes it a little bit easier than the Fusion webpage that we have because we, I know we always are looking for ways to have that two-way conversation. With Edmodo, after the parent gets the update, they can actually type a reply or ask a question. So that's a really great feature for um, using Edmodo as opposed to just a web page update. So you can see here, uh, parent, the parents are getting an update about a decoding strategy that we've introduced in the classroom. And it's just quick, easy, right there. They're not taken to another page. The information Hi, is right at their Here's fingertips. It's quick and easy. This week we've Another great way to use Edmodo in the kindergarten to first grade level is to differentiate by creating small groups. So you can see here, I'll circle it to give your attention. The small group icon here has a little plus sign where you can click on to add a group. However, I've already added a group just to save a little bit of time here. So we'll go right to the blue reading group. Now let's see, we want to differentiate. Maybe the blue reading group already knows the sight word of the week. So what we can do is we can go online, search for a sight word that we feel is more appropriate. So this one is a little bit more difficult. Let's say it's in the story this week. I'm going to click on the embed code here. Let me hold on. Got the embed code. I'm going to save it. Go back to my Edmodo. I'm going to create a post. Here is the sight word of the day. And it's L O O K. So maybe the student doesn't know that word yet. So I'm going to take my embed code and I'm going to put that in there. And I'm going to say sight word look and attach that for my students to see. And then I'm just gonna hit the blue send button. And this is what the students in the blue group will see when they log on. You can see right here, they're going to see the new um, video. It's gonna take them right to this fun interactive way to learn. You can see there aren't any ads, it's just right there. 
In addition to connecting with students and with parents, Edmodo is also a fantastic tool to connect with the outside world through things like the Global Read Aloud and the Flat Stanley Project. In addition to the small groups, you can actually connect with larger groups that are ready to go on Edmodo, like the Global Read Aloud. My class is going to connect with the Peter H. Reynolds Author Study. We're going to connect with other classrooms and talk about these wonderful books. Right on Edmodo! Beyond creating groups, you can also use apps through the Edmodo App Store. One that I'm particularly excited to try is the Flat Stanley app. This project has been connecting kids from around the world since 1994 and is now available through Edmodo. So there you have it. Edmodo can be used to help you differentiate in your classroom, to connect with your students, connect with your parents with two-way conversations, and to connect with the world. The next step is to sign up for your own Edmodo account. It's going to be quick, easy, and it's free. Take a look at video number two to see how to get started with Edmodo.